dedicated studio built from the ground up for sound is probably going to have acoustic treatment built into the room as it's being constructed. However, many people look to convert existing rooms into home theaters, studios, or listening rooms. Maybe you've got a spare bedroom you want to convert or a finished part of your basement that you want to use as a listening room. A lot of these rooms that people convert tend to be on the smaller size, and a smaller room is going to give you more issues as the reflections are going to be closer together and louder. That means you're going to get more peaks and nulls in your frequency response as certain sounds build up and cancel each other out within the room. Sound waves, like all waves, have peaks and troughs. When two waves interact, the respective peaks and troughs can combine depending on the phase of the wave. If two sound waves are exactly the same, but one is 180 degrees out of phase of the other, then they cancel each other out in what's called phase cancellation. So an in-phase sound will cause a peak or a buildup, whereas an out-of-phase sound will cause a null or a cancellation. This is where you get the nasty peaks and nulls from all of the reflections in your room that can make it hard to judge what you're actually listening to. Most of the issues you're likely to have are going to be in your lower frequencies because bass tones tend to have longer decay times, which means they're going to reflect more and build up in the room more, causing more peaks and nulls. This is why it's always a great first step to treat your first reflections and corners with thick absorption. We usually recommend between two and six inches of absorption in these areas. Absorption is such a great tool because it actually eliminates sound by converting sound energy into a minuscule amount of heat energy. This eliminates the sound altogether, preventing it from reflecting and creating those peaks and nulls. Have you ever noticed that bass instruments tend to be larger than most other instruments? Just in the same way that you need a larger instrument to create a lower tone, you need a thick panel in order to absorb it. The wavelength is physically larger. Thick broadband panels like the 244 Monster Softener Tri-Trap should make up the bulk of your low-end treatment strategy. Remember, the thicker the panel, the lower the effective range of absorption. But if you're looking for a more fine-tuned bass response, there are other patented GIK technologies that can help you. Our range limiters can help absorb more in the low end without impeding or over-absorbing that treble or high range, and our Scopus tuned bass traps can help you eliminate resonances at specific frequencies after you've done a bulk of your treatment. The other method we have for room treatment is diffusion. Unlike absorption, the purpose of diffusion is to scatter the sound throughout the room evenly in all directions. When sound hits a flat surface, it reflects off at the opposite angle just like light off of a mirror. If we take an acoustically reflective surface like wood, we can create a panel that has ridges, valleys, and mountains in it that will bounce the sound around and scatter it in all directions. There are other ways to create diffusion besides reflection, both with GIK's dedicated diffusers and with our hybrid devices that have both absorption, diffusion, and bass trapping built all in one. Diffusion can help with your frequency response by scattering sound around the room evenly. Diffusion also has the added benefit as it can change the natural characteristics of a room. It can make some rooms sound larger and can be very useful when overabsorption makes a room sound dead. Great sound in a small space is all about balance. You need great bass response with a neutral overall character. A well-treated production space should make your job easier to do faster with less frustrations and give you a better overall result. GIK Acoustics has a wide range of products that are both effective and affordable for achieving these goals. Be sure to reach out to us or fill out our free acoustic advice form and we'll make sure you get the very best sounding room for your space and budget. Get free acoustic advice. Visit GIKacoustics.com for educational articles and tutorials.